Hello, Katribuverse! Welcome to a sweet episode of Tribuno with yours truly, Miguel Paul Tagoda. Halloween isn't the only holiday when kids can have free candy, since Christmas is also about sweets. But with more variety, such as candy apples, peppermint moranges, snickerdoodle truffles, and today's topic, the classic candy cane. The cane-shaped candy stick is often associated with Christmas, as well as St. Nicholas Day. It is traditionally white with red stripes and flavored with peppermint, but also comes in a variety of other flavors and colors. According to NCA or the National Confessionaires Association in the United States, candy canes are the number one selling non-chocolate candy during the month of December with 90% of the red and white striped treats sold between Thanksgiving and Christmas. Tribune know that the creation of the candy cane dates back to 1670 when the choir master at the Cologne Cathedral in Germany handed out sugar sticks among his young singers to keep them busy eating during the living crochet ceremony. Susan Benjamin, founder of the True Treats Historic Candy, said the story has some credibility but it's just as likely Germans added the hook to hang them from trees alongside cookies, fruits, and other treats. NCA Public Affairs Manager Carly Schildos claimed that candy canes were only colored white for 200 years before its iconic red and white stripes. So, Katribuverse, do you have candy canes at home this Christmas? For past episodes of the show, like our official Daily Tribune and Constant News Central Facebook pages. Like and subscribe to our YouTube channel, Tribunal. See ya and Merry Christmas!